Right, I wanted to make a quick video um, just describing the difference between volume and capacity. Uh, so if we're thinking about a container that is storing some liquid, the amount of liquid that's actually in the container, this is what we would call the volume of the liquid. Okay. Um, typically we might measure that in, in millimeters cubed or centimeters cubed or meters cubed. Okay. Capacity, however, would be the maximum amount of storage in that um, container. So, for example, here I've got a bottle, and the maximum that this bottle can contain is one litre. Typically, capacity you'll see written in, in millimetres or litres, but actually that's basically the same as um, centimetres cubed almost, because one centimetre cubed is exactly the same as one millimetre, uh, and a thousand millimeters make a liter. So you could also say a thousand centimeters cubed make one liter. Okay, let's have a look at some quick questions. I wonder what you think. Why don't you pause the video if you want to guess what you think the capacity and the volume is for each of these shapes. So there's two of them there. Okay, the first one, the capacity of this container, or well, the maximum that it could store would be one liter. Okay, or you could also say a thousand uh, centimeters cubed. Uh, the volume, what is the volume of the water that's in there? Well, it's a half of that liter, isn't it? So it, we could say 500 millimeters, or we could say 500 centimeters cubed because it's the same unit. Right, for the next one, what's the capacity of this container? Well, the maximum that it can contain is 600 centimeters cubed. Or we could say 600 millimetres. And the volume of water, well, it's two thirds of that, isn't it? So two thirds of 600 is 400 centimetres cubed. And again, I could, I could have said 400 millimetres. Um, so yeah, that's, that's a quick difference between volume and capacity. Josh Maths. <laughs>